I am Kapil, Kapil Bhopatkar. I am the managing partner of this theatre, Bharat Mata Cinema. Uh, the theatre has the distinction of being the only theatre in Mumbai which consistently screens Marathi movies. Marathi is our local language, our regional language in Maharashtra. And uh, also the theatre has been associated uh, as a part of the mill culture uh, which were there in and around this theatre. Uh, it all started, say, way back in 1930s when uh, cinema was introduced. And the plot on which this theatre stands uh, was a plot that was reserved for entertainment as an entertainment zone for the surrounding mill. And uh, Mumbai also had a very different culture back then. It was not crowded. In fact, uh, not many people were willing to stay here. So the British, they had a problem of uh, how to keep the employees in Mumbai because they used to come, work in the mills for a few days and then go back to their native village, which was mostly Konkan. And um, when the money got over, they used to come back. So that disrupted the production schedule of the mills. So that is why you see they decided to build chawls because the problem of the person coming to Mumbai was, where do I stay? But once the chawls were built, uh, the Britishers and the mill owners uh, collectively realized that what needs to be done is basically to give them uh, an entire culture and entertainment being a part of the culture and movies were the next big thing so they decided to build a theater so they hired a, a architect his name was mr engineer and he built this theater and the theater was built and then they kind of realized that they don't know how to run the theater because one needed to get the films my grandfather at that point in time uh, mr sadashiv bhopatka was a silent film actor and also was dabbling in film distribution and theatre management. So that is how my family came into the picture in say 1937. And 1937-38 we started running the theatre. And uh, what we did after my grandfather started running the theatre was uh, we changed the name of the theatre. Original name of the theatre was uh, Lakshmi Theatre. And then uh, he changed it to Bharat Mata. Bharat Mata means Mother India. Also, what he did was he realized that the bulk of the audience would be the mill workers. And he opened the theater for the mill workers. Okay, We used to have our show timings adjusted according to the uh, shifts in the mill. And uh, that is how we started uh, you know, having our own patrons. And by 1941-42, we were pretty set. And uh, that is how we you know, uh, converted a theatre which was meant exclusively for the British officers and we threw it open to the general public. Our sudden jerk came in uh, 1984 because in 1984 there was a mill strike. At 82 the momentum started but 84 the mills shut down. And when the mills shut down uh, we lost our patrons because they were unemployed, they didn't have money. So we suffered a jerk. Also uh, another reason was uh, the fact that uh, video parlors had started and video was the next big thing in the mid 80s so everyone entire industry to a lesser or a greater extent was it uh, but we survived that storm we did what we could do and generally uh, times were bad and uh, i remember my father you know was being interviewed by a journalist and he was asked okay what do you think because uh, Practically everyone thought that this was the death of theatre, this was the death of uh, uh, watching cinema the way it was and everything would be changed and nobody would come to the theatre. So my father told him that as a human being, we would like to spend time not alone but in the company of others. Uh, the whole aspect of watching a film on a theatre, in a theatre is to watch it as a collective experience and that nothing can give you that experience and he was pretty right. We had the cable area uh, era uh, coming in in the early 1990s and now we to have about say 200, 250 channels but we are surviving along with them. There have been multiplexes that have sp uh, sprung up all over the place. Uh, but uh, as we know that uh, the ticket prices are prohibitively costly for some and that class would still come to Bharat Mata Sena. The numbers 
have diminished slightly but so they have for all theaters bharat mata is not an exception uh, but what you need to understand is that the mill workers survived that strike okay they didn't go back not all of them went back to the villages they stayed here they fought and the next generation of the mill workers who are probably working in the malls or are working at good corporates so the next generation once again has come back to bharat mata